Folic acid is not found in natural food. It's not the same thing as folate that's found in vegetables and beans. And folic acid is linked to increased risk of cancer, like prostate and breast cancer. And that it's not wise to be taking folic acid supplements in any form, even when you're pregnant. So that's another, probably in my opinion, a strong cause of childhood cancer and increased deaths in this country. Because they give people folic acid when they're pregnant to prevent neural tube defects, instead of telling women they have to eat green vegetables to get folate. So they can take folic acid. It's like telling you to take diabetic medications for your diabetes instead of eating right and exercising to reduce your blood sugar. It's the same thing. Give them folic acid to help the neural tube defects, and they don't have to worry about their diet now and eat green vegetables. Why not just tell them to eat green vegetables to get the folate? Because now we find out that the leading cause of death in children, other than accidents, is acute blastocytic leukemia, a cancer that's linked in the scientific studies to lack of vegetables in the mother's diet, not just during conception, but also prior to pregnancy. And we have brain tumors in children that are linked to consumption of luncheon meats and bad diets, and we have autism in children linked to junk food. So instead of getting women on a healthy diet to get their folate, and that will stop not only neural tube defects, but will stop other birth defects as well. Instead of that, we say, keep going to McDonald's and keep getting junk food and keep eating commercial bakers and just take folic acid pills to prevent neural tube defects. It's a missed opportunity to tell women how important it is for them to eat healthy food so they have a healthy baby. So now we just let them eat an unhealthy food and we give them folic acid. It's representative of what's wrong with healthcare and medicine in general.